looking at the Watson guy. How is everyone doing? Hopefully everyone is doing well. Y'all know how these Watson guides go. We just go straight into it. So getting better at Watson. She only has a few key components to her kit. The main component to her kit is the door trick obviously. So the way you want to practice the door trick is find an isolated area. A lot of you will watch my gameplay. I tend to veer away from a lot of enemies. I don't want to deal with enemies. So we are going to pick up this ammo real quick. And the door trick immediately. So the way you want to practice the door trick is have the door be closed and then through the door you're going to grab the the node and then place it at the end of the ring. See that? The door will open up and if you have enemies on the other side, this is when you want to obviously shoot them. See that? Pro tip for Watson that I'll do also is I'll use the zappers as a way to get better at aiming. So since there's different rows of each zapper typically I'll practice my aim on the top row the reason for that is this way you're able to practice your recoil control so the practice recoil control is to trace you could say these bars right also a thing too for the alt, I'm going to show you guys in a pro tip with the alt. Get to a knight. Oh shoot, he's right here. Oh my god. Alright, next round we will show y'all the pro tip with the alt. Man's thinking he's something with the Pathfinder wall bounce. Bro. You're not him. On oh God. So, using the alt, I mean, I'll, I'll just show y'all once we get into the next round. But yeah, a little review of the door trick. If I was inside of the door right now, or just now, what I could have done was, when the Pathfinder was pushing me, I could have just gone to the door and Right when he was at the door, I could have easily zapped him. It's just my intentionality of that moment. I was trying to little finesse with the alt. So, it is no issue. We are loading right back into the next match. Goodness, I got murked by a Pathfinder just now, and the voice intro clip quip was just of the Pathfinder voice. Again, going to a nice isolated area where there are no enemies. I think this place outside of the caustic area is actually a pretty nice place to fight, so let's go over there. the door trick again so I'm gonna press the door right here open it up I think a better place let me place it a little bit better so if I place it right there right if the pathfinder pushed me just now zap him up and then at least I could do damage another way I'll practice also is when I have a weapon let's say the peacekeeper the triple take whatever you may have what I'll end up doing is 
doing a 360 before I shoot. Also, for any of those people that have watched my previous Apex videos, I talk about aiming with multiple fingers. So, pause. Hello. What I'll do is aim with my ring fingers. And also to, to get better at aiming is to learn how to spam practice with the weapons. Spam practicing with the weapons necessarily is a better way to get better faster. And then to get even more precise with your aim, you want to shoot the doors. See that? The wingman's really powerful because you're able to do dam not damage you could say, but opening up doors with up doors with the wingman shots so also learning how to fence vertically is Watson super important oh my god he's shooting me okay I got piked couldn't even get inside of the building just now Got triple taked and then just sprayed by a. I'm pretty sure it was. What gun is that? A nemesis? That's oh, a revenant. I was gonna say I got shot by R301, but that's just because I saw it on the ground. y'all can hear the lo-fi music we all in a relaxing mood There's gonna be enemies landing here. Oh, oh, I mean, out the drop shit, we don't see a lot of enemies, so hopefully, I can just practice in this area. Keyword, hopefully. For some reason, everyone wants. Drop my practice. So, little movement tip also for Watson is when you have the fence saw, you get a movement boost. See that? And if I don't wall bounce off here, another thing too with movement boost is if Watson has no more fences, just pull a nade out and you still get that movement boost. See that? So. As I was saying earlier too, when I practice my aim, let's say with a peacekeeper, a triple take, during the wind up, I'll do 360s to get really good at the aim. See that? I'm getting a different target. Even that door over there. See that? If that door is a target. I'll shoot the door. Here, I'll show you. The door. Do a 360 real quick. Shoot the door again. Do a 360 real quick. Shoot the door again. 360 real quick. The door again, 360 will click. The door right here, this door's a little bit smaller, but still is effective. When an enemy pulls up, you're gonna zap that door real quick. See that? See how rapid the. Yo, Shadow Fire Force, rapid got me 
in awe. Man does the does a whole hand sign jutsu and just gains speed. I mean, the audience and no one was complaining about that either. I mean, y'all saw the show with Shino play that went hard. Okay, here we go. Let me just pick right here. I see, I would practice with the P2020, I just don't want to. It's not that it's a bad gun. The P2020 is up there with one of the top guns. It's just I want to learn recoil patterns. So, when you practice recoil patterns, you want to choose a spot. And then just have all the bullets be as near each other as possible. For example, that ring console over there, let's say there's an enemy on that ring console over there. What I'll do is I'll practice my aim on that ring console. Okay, here we go. This is the alt thing I was talking about. So after you place your alt down, there's a way to wall bounce off the alt. See that? That's pro tip Watson's right there for a movement boost. I got pulled up on obviously. Couldn't even get into a building. I had all these zappers, I had my alt out, all this different stuff. They already caught me mid reload, so. No, I'm gonna destroy my ult. That's free shields. You do not need to destroy the ult, it is free shields. The ult is free aim practice, so these players are trying to get their aim practice in. It's kind of funny. 